There's nothing as valuable as family. They keep us grounded, they build us up, and they let us soar. But what if you found out the family that had raised you from birth wasn't your birth family at all? For our next guest, an out of the blue call changed everything. Here with us today is Ellen Lindsay and investigative genealogist Pam Slayton. Thank you ladies so much for joining us today. So Ellen, you received a call from Pam saying that you were adopted. What was that moment like? Well, if you take it back a little, three years ago, Pam called me. Okay. Originally, and she stated that someone wanted to, from my past wanted to meet me. Uh-huh. I was like, there's no one in my past that I want to meet because... <laughs> <laughs> no, because I was married and, yeah. you know, I didn't... You right, think you didn't want to go through all that. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. And so my wife was like, well, you know, you should go ahead and meet him. Um, I don't know, don't remember whatever took place, why it never came to pass, but I always say it wasn't God's timing. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then uh, almost a year next month, Pam reached out to me again. That's when I, she told me, she said, yeah, I called, I spoke to you three years ago and told you wow. you were adopted. I said, honey, you ain't never told me I was adopted. Oh! <laughs> You're like, I missed well, that part. Anyway. <laughs> so what happened there was I had a client that said, you know, I'm looking for my sister, born on this day, and I had this long list, and I kept eliminating people of who I knew was not the missing sister. Okay. Mm -hmm. But Ellen just kept coming back up, and I kept thinking, this has got to be her. I just felt it in my bones. Were you born in Elizabeth, New Jersey? Yes, I was. So I called back again, I said, listen, would you do a DNA test for me? Let, let's, let's flush this out and let's get to the bottom of if you are an adoptee or if you're not. And then you found out that she was adopted. So yes. how did you feel about that? Because did you know? You were yeah. adopted. I, no, I never knew. Wow. Like I was 49 when she told me, almost, well, I turned 50 in March. So for 49 years, I never knew. Now 50. Wow. wow. Wait, I want to take this back, Pam, as an investigative genealogist, what is that search like to find Ellen? Out with a date of birth, and you just kind of go through data, and what you're looking yeah. at, like for me, you know, are the parents that are associated with that person born on that day, are they much older? You know, are they younger, you know, in the 20s, because they're not going to adopt. So when I see someone who's got parents that are 30 plus years old, they get on a short list and then I start whittling the list down. Wow. And her parents were considerably older than is the norm for someone to have a biological child. And I knew she was born in Elizabeth, New Jersey, where the adoptee was born. So it was, I just kept thinking, it's got to be her. So I just, I kept popping up periodically yeah. and she kept saying, go away. And <laughs> finally she did the DNA and here we are. Wow. Wow. Okay. So... Do you know that there are family here today looking for you? Yes, she, she did tell me that. Yes, so you have a half-sister.